Shania Etwaki wato Dina na dai ajiya gwamnatin Woro na liyan Kinanja State bana na Honorable Umaru Muhammad Bahu na wafi ba na to tishi makanta ba na juji kakari chacha na wato primary school beto de ya machuji be fedo sarayi a be zanje de mun da yazin be yi jiyo na a shi gidwayo ya de zanje ja ba kakai tutu cikin da nan dai Honorable Bahu a jiji Kinanja shiga dai gwarallo na Bahu is a very, very exposed person, both at the federal and now as a governor. And I'm sure Abuja will relocate to Niger State. Is that what Niger State want? Niger State won? So we're going to toast for a good health, for an excellent service, and for a better, greater love and development, both infrastructure and human capital development for Niger State. Um, we are going to toast to the glory of God, our Maker. Hip hip hip. Hip hip hip. hip. That was a very wonderful toast, but uh, very honourable. Here with us. sa koyan komiti na dai ala e ba jamla ke lokin nan jaba nan nan dr mawdu kudu central ke o shibe lami pa ganji bago this is an event that is being organized and funded mostly by friends of bago and it is being organized in the honor of two of them that is both the governor elect himself and his deputy it is, it is quite obvious that this promises to be a very joyful, joyful evening. And I would, like every, I would like to welcome everyone to relax and enjoy the evening. I have the privilege of welcoming every one of us to this program that is planned by some of the colleagues and friends of our governor. We've known him way back in the bank where we are friends and all that. And he has been a passionate, resilient, and team player. Because we want to be associated with his success and to celebrate him, we just decided to have this little gathering. And we pray that this, your tenor will be a tremendous one. You will have the wisdom to rule the state, and we will have our prayers. I will always be in your support. Manager of the Ninja State Development Company, Dr. Momo Jimo, and Umar, who is a leader of the Ninja State. He is a leader of the Ninja State. What are the broad classifications of opportunities in Ninja State? Clearly, number one, the agriculture. The two, is solid minerals and mining. Thirdly, Tourism and hospitality. Fourth, education. Fifth, what I would call intellectual capacity of the state. Now, but what has qualified Niger State for all of this? I will try and share with all of us the premium, the joy, the attractiveness, the things that make Niger State stand out. Number one, centrally located, bordered by Zamfara, Kemi, Kogi, Para, and Katna and FCC. That is one of the locations. Two, in terms of land mass, eighty five percent of this land is arable, can be cultivated, and is productive. So what are we waiting for? Number three, the soil type in Niger State can hold water and can resist any kind of erosion challenges. That is the only one that no other state in Nigeria can boast of, and is here in Niger State. Number four, what I would say very hospitable and warm people. A Nigerite would always receive you well. That in itself is a major attractive investment option. Number five, the population of Niger State at about 6.4 million, whether we like it or not, is good enough to be managed, enumerated, and to make sure that all everybody here is engaged. That's also another good one. Now, the estimated GDP of Niger is about 2.4 trillion. I can make safe that Niger State has the capacity to go to 20 trillion. And therefore, with governor elect and deputy government and the team here, we are headed for that place. 
Katizo chiche kakai na mamina abu Sablis, BG, Sibombo, International, Arewa, YAC Abezi zanije zuzo bansa gijina Na jifebe daga papa kwa otoba na tsobana De la shana na demi mwa Bana atuwa kutuzo ji kakai na So na jaji ya tuwa gina na ya na Onabu Muhammad Umar Bago Shibye la mi pa ganshi kede In the United States The guest speaker spoke Eloquently He spoke on issues Ranging from Natural Material and human resources Our capacity as a state But inshallah We are standing tall before you today to tell you that by Allah will make the difference. And we are calling on everybody, everybody to join hands with us in the development of Niger State. It's not going to be a rosy, rosy. We know that. But inshallah, we are called to the task. So we can reassure you that on security inshallah to be a thing of the past the cp and other security agencies here present let me thank you and to reassure you of our maximum cooperation in making sure that we we, we live peacefully in niger state to my colleagues at the national assembly I'm just on sabbatical here. But I know after the Rick Maro, I will come back home. So I've not come empty handed. I'm going to come back with a lot of presents to show that I've done what you have sent me to do. Again, to our families. You've persevered years after years. My wife, can you move from let me look at my wife? I remember those days in the bank. Geneto, when you said Dobi and you said uh, Babula, all those were my names, yeah. But she was behind me. Sometimes I'll come home, my children will be sleeping. I will leave for work, they will still be sleeping. And when they see me, weekends they clinch on me. But she stood by me all throughout those years. <laughs> and when I finally ventured into politics, it was crazy. And she stood by me. So I want to ask you for more patience, I wanted to persevere more with me and with all of us. You have been a good wife and a good mother. I can't thank you enough. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs>